to six of them, and we had five, uh, and we lost one Haley Kesselman to St. Louis University through graduation. But we have the rest of our kids back from that. Your expectations for the second week season? I see opponents out there, so I'm afraid to say. <laughs> Preseason coaches picked us at, as third. That was before Michaela's passing, so you know, who knows? We know the conference is going to be extremely tough. Um, so I'm scared to say, but. Now, I feel good about it, and you know, we'll just see what happens when we tip it up. We've talked a lot about how life and sports and impacting each other and, and how you mature as a person. Forget the basketball side, but it teaches you a lot of life lessons that you use throughout your life. You still use as a coach and, and, and as an adult, and, and this sort of thing really helps build character, build people, doesn't it? When you go through the adversity that like you guys have gone through. Yes, I mean, it's still very difficult, but. <laughs> No, I'm saying you're fine. You're, you're fine. It is a, it is a di very difficult thing for, for girls and for you. And, and again, our thoughts and prayers go with, with everybody. We, pre we appreciate you coming out today. Thank you. I mean, we're just trying to, I mean, we have learned a lot. We realize that wins are not what it's all about anymore. And, you know, we're just going to try to do our best. And, we're, you know, we're going to play for Michaela this year. And hopefully, you know, she's looking down on us. And, you know, it's just one of those deals that, you know, basketball's not everything. And for my life, it's been a large part of it, but it does make you step back and think there's other things that are a lot more important. Coach, we appreciate you coming out and giving us some time today. Thank you. Thanks, dear. Sandy Ryan.